We're going to solve this system. Three by three, three equations, three variables. So I'm going to rewrite it as a uh, matrix. 1x, 2y, 1z, and a 5. 3x is, whoops, negative 1y is 1z, and a negative 2, 4, 1, 2, 0. Great. So there is my matrix right there. Let me make some zeros. I think that I will try and make one uh, right here and right here. So uh, it should be pretty straightforward. Um, I think I'll go row 2 minus row 1 just to keep some of them positive. I don't know that it matters. Could have gone row 1 minus row 2. I'll also go um, row 3 minus 2 times row 1. Put that into, whoops, I'm going to put this into row 2. This one, Sorry. And put this one into row 3. So row 2 minus row 1. Uh, first row is unaffected. 3 minus 1 is 2. Negative 1 minus 2. That should be a negative 3. 1 minus 1 is 0. Negative 2 minus 5 is negative 7. That feels good. Uh, row 3 minus 2 times row 1. So 4 times 2 times 1 is, is, I'm sorry, 4 minus 2 times 1 is 2. 1 minus 2 times 2. Uh, so that's 1 minus 4. That's a negative 3. 2 minus 2 is 0. 0 minus... 5 times mm, five times 2 is negative 10. And uh, if you'll notice, these there's some shenanigans going on here. These are the almost the same. Uh, so I'm just going to subtract um, row, three, uh, row 2 minus row 3. Put that into row 3. So first row unaffected, second row unaffected, third row affected. 2 minus 2 is 0. 3 minus negative 3 is 0. 0 minus 0 is 0. Ugh. Negative 7 minus negative 10. That's a 3. So now I have this statement. 0 equals 3. Nonsense. No solution.